Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Bundesliga. It's Bochum and they face Köln. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. The lineup then for the hosts. Well, it's regarded as a negative shape if they control the middle of the park, play some expansive football, the wide players can then come in field to join the centre forward and the fullbacks can push on. Let's hope they do that today. So the starting 11 for Köln. Well, with this lineup, they certainly won't dominate possession. But if they can defend well, counter-attack quickly, and get their front players combining, they'll pose a threat today. And now they get the ball rolling. Anthony Modest. Mark Oot. Now it's Kainz. Anthony Modest. Skiri. They really look after the ball. Well, he hit it with authority. Close. Staffy Ladies. Well timed tackle. Anthony Modest. Now can they make something happen? Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Shielding the ball superbly. Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? Dejan Jubicic defensive Brazilians to shut them down Elvis Rejbetsai he could pick out a teammate decent position just couldn't capitalise there Elias Skiri. Timo Hubers. Oot with it. On attacking possibilities. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. And it was a good looking sequence, but it comes to an end. Lucia. Run it magnificently and intercepted. A foul, but advantage played. Uzchan. Mm -hmm. 
Mark Oot. Schmitz. Luca Kilian. Oot with it. Anthony Modest. Takes on the shot. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Trying to pick out a teammate, foiling them effectively. Won it back. And the attack looks promising. Mark Oot. Well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. Playing it in, not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Could be troublesome. Kainz. And now Oot. Oh dear, not a great effort, was it? Well, this has to get better because, as those stats confirm, the attack in play from both sides just hasn't been good enough. It's all been a little bit too cautious so far. Leuven. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle. And the referee has got to book him, I think. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Oh, a lovely ball. And so it is, the first half story has been written. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Lucia. And Rej Betsai with it. Another eyeing that final pass, you just feel. Well, if you make your move too early, you're always in danger of being ruled offside. players waiting in the middle really vital interception racing forward trying to catch them out well that break looked so promising but nothing coming from it oh that's an interesting pass it comes to nothing in the end Excellent refereeing, advantage in operation. Mark Oot. 
Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking it to come, you would think. And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. And time for the change now. And very deftly cut out. Now we're into the final half hour. It's for looking position, you've got to say. Özcan. Kainz. A fine use of the ball. He takes aim. A goal! On the back of sustained pressure. Now they deservedly hold the advantage. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power, but just look at the follow-through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. Well, back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Mark Oot. And you saw the situation developing. And the pass could do damage. That's all they can conjure for now. Good looking ball. Zali Özcan with it. Elias Skiri. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. Well, spot on with that challenge. He continues his run. And the keeper will happily collect that one. And couldn't keep himself onside. Substitution time it is here. Timo Hubers. Now we're inside the final ten minutes in this one. Well, by playing keep ball like this, they're keeping the opposition at bay. And a strong tackle. He's using his strength to good effect. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Dangerous looking attack. Zali Özcan with it. Oh, it might be. Oh, terrific piece of goalkeeping. Well, they'll be looking to add to their advantage from this corner. So, making the substitution now. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, no problems defensively. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. David Holtmann. Now still pressing for a goal here. 
not to be advised giving the ball away in that position and there goes the final whistle much to the disappointment of their supporters well Derek certainly not their best performance was it just a little bit off the pace for me and obviously a disappointing result but the key thing is they bounce back now and they can't afford a repeat performance but it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Yeah, he deserved to score the winner today because he was a real handful. He's running off the ball and awareness of space were excellent. Very impressive.